Hey guys, welcome back to uh, Daniel's Tech World on YouTube Medium and DanielRosal.tech. So uh, continuing with some, uh, this is just a quick uh, trick that I thought I would, uh, I thought I would put out there on my account. So you get is a multi-thread download manager for Linux, and uh, <coughs> continuing with the backup jobs I'm running at the moment. Um, one thing that I am doing is just taking a download of my uh, photos, a big photo album essentially. Um, I'm putting those on the NES so it's very very heavy and uh, the download on the server is painfully painfully slow um, so what happened last night was I was in the middle of downloading this um, I saw that because there was a couple of CR download files which are incomplete download files and that was running for about six or eight hours overnight so that's a real pain when you um, accidentally shut down the computer and uh, find that you haven't downloaded an entire archive um, you know because you need to basically start from scratch that's why doing stuff from Google Chrome can be disadvantageous um, because if the download stops getting it back if you've already cl closed down the computer you've lost that Chrome session it's not easy by contrast um, if you use something like you get um, it kind of replicates the functionality of something like curl or wget where you can have these operators for continuous download and kind of resume um and leave off that that download job um you know after after putting the computer in suspend or whatever so basically these are the galleries that i want to download and i'm going to go for the high resolution ones i have the low res versions on uh one of my cloud hosting providers just as a backup but uh, I'm going to put the full res on the NAS. So I'm going to click. You can see this is one of these photography websites. Download full gallery high res. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get two links. Download to computer. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the option to uh, download to that many places in the cloud. Uh, so I'll just do computer. Um, now it's giving me... This is not really... This is not a link I can inspect. So what I'm just going to do is start. It's a two-part download of 12146 images and I'm just gonna let these trigger the download jobs now as soon as that happens I'm just gonna jump into the download manager and I'm gonna hit pause and I'm gonna hit pause I have one and two and the first one's gonna be a lot heavier it's 1200 images versus 146 and what I can do is this has provided a URL to me so we can just uh, copy from Chrome into here and we can see this is you know it's a download URL um, it looks like that's enough information let's just take the second one onto our clipboard too and uh, keep those over there uh, it would be nice if this wrapped but whatever um, so now I'm just gonna bring over you get and what I can do is just uh, oops I can just uh, go file new download and uh, just add these into the into the tool that's the first one let's just uh, okay and it takes a second to just kind of you can see what's happening here to just kind of accept that and uh, this looks like it's fine uh, so we have 22 megabytes or download downloaded and uh, now we can go ahead and add our second URL And you can see that for a second it said download, and then it switched to the actual uh, it the actual target uh, object that it's downloading, which is photos. We have photos here one of two and two of two dot zip, and uh, now the download is in progress. So that's that's basically the the trick. Uh, you just kind of start a download, go into download manager, and I can now exit out of these uh, because the downloads are running. I think it actually might confuse it if it's uh, two places. Um, the downloads are now operating in UGET and uh, I can go ahead and do things like uh, shut down or uh, sorry put the computer into suspend uh, I don't need to worry about keeping Chrome open while this is going on uh, but I am still downloading this from the internet thanks for watching any questions uh, or just want to get in touch my website is danielrosel.co.il